from the beginning, Ben and Jerry both um, focused their business, part of their business, on having a philanthropic and social mission, um, with po a portion of the profits of Ben and Jerry's always being donated to the Ben and Jerry's Foundation, um, which has uh, participated in many, many good works, uh, many kinds of projects for social justice and progress in the United States. There is a spiritual aspect to business, just as there is to the lives of individuals. As you give, you receive. As you help others, you are helped in return. And just because the idea that the good that you do comes back to you is written in the Bible and not in some business textbook doesn't mean that it's any less valid. If we have a world in which for whatever reason, there are a lot of people who are privileged, and then there's a lot of people who don't get a fair shake. And social justice is evening that field, so everybody has an opportunity. I think it's critically important for a sustainable planet. Uh, you know, if, if you want to have a world in which there's haves and have-nots, it's not that important. But uh, that is not a world that will uh, thrive and continue. I think for Grinnell to be recognizing young people who are changing the world in a positive way is a great statement. And I think uh, Grinnell taking the lead in terms of social justice and equality is a great thing for Grinnell to be doing. So I think it really positions the college uh, as saying this is a stake in the ground. This is something we believe in. For the prize winners, you know, they're, they're doing the work anyway, but it, it's nice to be recognized for what you're doing. Uh, it's not why people do it. It's not why people are engaged in uh, making the world better and more sustainable, but it's always nice to get recognized.